Hi, I'm Justine Major, Regional Recovery Officer for Northern SA, and I'm here today with Mary O'Brien, founder of the RU Bogged Mate initiative. Hi Mary, how are you going? I'm well, Justine. That's good. I was just wondering, would you mind telling us a little bit about the RU Bogged Mate initiative? RU Bogged Mate is about talking to rural men in their comfort zone around the country, so getting to some remote locations where the, where the men are and um, connecting with them and connecting them with the support services that are out there. Can you tell us a little bit more about your unique approach to encouraging men to speak up about these? So I guess it's um, just turning it into language that they understand and making it more user friendly, particularly for rural men, rather than, um, I guess, getting bogged down in the, the psychology speak and the theory of it. It's more about making it practical and hands on for them. And how do you see addressing the mental health issues as an important part of the drought preparedness, recovery and response? Look, I think it's absolutely critical. As we know, drought impacts on families and communities in, in rural Australia all the time. And any, any health issue, doesn't matter what it is, being um, you know, early intervention and being better prepared and healthier is always the best start. So getting in there early and making sure that they don't get bogged down in mental health issues is um, can only be a benefit to the to the whole community. Sure. Can you give us some feedback or some examples um, of um, how the impact of what you're doing has had on regional Australia? I get a lot of emails from men in particular and from women, but from men just saying thank you for um, understanding us and for making it simple and user friendly, I guess, for them. So uh, I definitely have had some emails back from men who have sought support and professional help when they really needed it and saved a few lives, so that's really positive. Excellent. Well, thank you so much for your time today, Mary. I really appreciate having you in my region. Thanks, Justine.